Ciao, it's Victor Rogue. I'm sure all of us have traveled in our lifetime. Even if it's just to like the next town or maybe to your neighbor. And we all know this when we travel, we see people do things very differently than us. And have you ever had that thought in your mind like, oh my God, how can they do this? How is that possible? I can never do that. That's, that's out of this world. And we all, we all have those thoughts when we look and observe someone else's life and someone else's culture, someone else's religion, or maybe someone, the way they dress or the way they eat. And what I have experienced this past few weeks with not consuming any food is that it almost feels like it, I've always been doing this. It's, it's like my life. I wake up in the morning and I'm like, okay, you know, let's go, let's walk around, let's work out, let's move, let's express myself, let's just do my routine and I don't think about food anymore. And it just kind of be became the way my life is. I think the important thing to realize is that you can really do and make any change in your life you can do any, anything, any of that. But what helped me is not looking at, at the big scale. For example, oh my God, I wanna be healthier, right? And I wanna eat better. Oh, I'm gonna do this for the whole entire year. <laughs> that goal is very, very big and it, it puts a lot of stress and expectations on yourself. And most, most likely you're gonna fail. You know, because then like you think of all the things you're gonna miss instead of all the things that you're gonna gain. And for me, I have always failed when I try to make long-term goals. I work better with short-term goals. For example, I am I am gonna do this for this week, and then, for example, you can use as I'm gonna eat better, plant based this week, and then when the week passes, you're like, oh my god. That was actually really easy and I actually feel better. I can probably go another two weeks. And then you do that. And then you keep going. And then, and then you realize that it becomes kind of like a habit. And then you, you don't really have to think about it anymore. And then it's just like, you just do it. It's so easy. And that's what we all want to get with, with habits. And with things that we want to make a change in our lives. You just have to go over the mountain. You just have to go over. You have just have to go over that little corner over there. Once you cross that, you're good to go. And then it's just like easy sailing all the way through. And that's with making any change in your life, you know. That's what I feel like really helped me and my my feelings on habits. We are habitual creatures we can get used to anything anything you can get used to anything we just have to make sure you do it make the smallest change every single day and that long term is gonna have a huge 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 effect on your life and in your health all right um, don't forget take back your power